what's up YouTube it's Curly Victoria back with another video if you guys are new to my channel thanks for tuning in and if you've already been subscribed thanks for coming back I've gave this disclaimer in like all my videos tonight but my hair is not done okay sis your girl is at home she's working on a lot of things I did not go out looking like this I'm just at home looking like this right now um so I'm working on my laptop right now on a bunch of things but one awaited long requested type of video that I decided to make tonight um it's basically on how I got the games that I got okay so y'all might be looking at my thumbnail thinking who does she photoshop baby we didn't photoshop anybody that's me honey that's me okay so make sure you smash the subscribe button if you guys want to see you know more videos on my fitness more videos on vlogs lifestyle and maybe even hauls but yeah so my legs let's talk about them so I've always had like more of a toned leg I know that sounds weird legs not leg but even growing up I used to love fitness when I would work out I would always go for a run I would literally do indoor workouts and the same thing happened once I got to college as well and then after college I would always do those workouts now because I always stayed in shape I worked out all the time your girl legs was on fleek and even though my butt wasn't as um, defined as now because I ran a lot which I feel like I said this in other videos and I still believe this when you run like a lot I feel like there's a certain butt that runners have opposed to girls who lift over the last few years I've been lifting opposed to just running so I, I've done both so over time my legs have progressively began to look better in its toned form now I've always been toned legs always been you know not fat solid but over time over these last like couple years i've noticed more definition and i have to attribute that to my squats to lifting and to stair workouts and you know just more workouts that focus on glutes um even doing wall sits and stuff like that like your girl your girl goes in when it comes down to games also i do take um or drink um vegan protein shakes okay so i have my vegan protein by women's best which i'll link in the description box below not sponsored but love them i actually use my vegan protein whenever i like work out and want a good smoothie type vibe slash protein shake and if you don't know it protein helps build muscle like literally while your sleep is still building muscle and repairing muscle and things like that so I do have my protein shakes I do make sure I work out with protein shakes because I believe that they can turn into fat um but I do I have my protein shake because I do want to build my muscle now my target area right now is my belly you guys know when I completely went plant-based two and a half years ago then transitioned it to vegan within that two and a half years your girl tacked on 45 to 50 plus pounds okay I know a lot of people say oh you're gonna lose weight when you go plant-based or you go vegan I was completely opposite I tacked on 45 to 50 pounds um, plus over like a year span of time I began to notice all the weight in my belly I looked like I was six to eight months pregnant um, okay not eight months I'm doing doing a little much I looked about six seven months pregnant um, the belly was just full of bloat and I'm pretty sure you know inflammation and all of that so I went on a quest to kind of lose you know the weight because I was not impressed so I went from 180 pounds to um, 159 pounds which is like where I'm at currently and I've always been somebody who was in the 120s like you know 130s so to see 180 on the scale was definitely a heartbreaker so instead of just crying about it I actually did something about it and I literally dropped 21 pounds over a span of time and I am working to drop at least minimum 30 more to get back to 129 120s and then I will see if I'm gonna go down or go up based off of the 120 range um but it was literally devastating so throughout the process of losing the belly fat and losing the additional weight your girl still worked her gains I still literally lifted obviously when the gyms closed during COVID I just turned my stairs into stair workouts I will run my stairs up and down like for literally like 16 to 20 sets or 10 sets of up down up down and then I would come in the house, I would do squats, I would also go for a run outside, I would literally do wall sits, I would just do exercises that help my glutes, but simultaneously trying to do things like eating right, um, drinking my detox water, drinking apple cider vinegar, drinking coffee, drinking things that I know are going to help me have 
really, really good bowel movements because that will be taking the additional waste out of my stomach. So in the process of trying to lose the belly fat, I was still building the leg muscles and things like that because I'm looking at the overall body. As the stomach slowly goes down and the legs build, it's gonna be just such a beautiful sight when my belly loses that belly fat and then it starts to turn into abs and it turns into, you know, like fitness, well not fitness, it turns into a vibe. And then my arms, like my arms are never like flabby, but I'm still working. I do, you know, dumbbell curls. I do, you know, arm lifts and things like that. I do, you know, workouts on my weight bench. So I got those legs like that by being consistent, guys. I literally will do 100 squats in a day. I will literally still go for a run, still do stair workouts. Um, when the gym was open, I would bike. And like I said, I would also do, um, I would lift. So that's just a contribution of consistency and even though the gym's not open i feel like the the number one thing that you can build the best because the gyms are not well the gym might not want to go back to the gym like me i haven't been wanting to go to the gym i want to work out at home is your legs that's the quickest and the fastest that you can grow because it's like you can do so many things leg workouts to just build your using your body weight to build your legs so I've actually fallen more in love working out at home than I did in the gym. Only thing I'm missing in the gym is the super heavy weights when I'm lifting. Other than that, everything else is pretty much handled at home. So that's how I built my glutes. I will still be um, letting you guys know weigh-in updates and things like that when it comes to my fitness. But if you guys want to see more, then make sure you like, comment, share, subscribe. And I'll see you all in the next video. Later. It's only 11 something